focus is good enough that we can see the position of your four ball valves at the top of the picture for the big uh, SBS engine. Oh, it's went to watch, man. Hopefully, uh, you'll see the, uh, or we'll see the two on the left here, uh, set A, go on here directly. Minus six minutes. They bust eyes two on, uh, Fred. The SDS helium valve two auto, and the uh, check to auto power pole. ABC zero powers, one AC one main A, two AC two main B. AC one main A, AC two main B. Main bus times, okay, rotational power, model, or two AC. The two AC. Direct two off. Direct two off. Deep mag, three at one rate two. At one rate two. Space cap control SCS. CS. Yeah. And RPA controller. Right, C-armed. Okay, let's do a primary DVC check. Ready, you ready to start primary? Okay, go ahead, primary. Okay, pitch one, start. Good. Yaw one, start. That one's good. Double L control. Point nine six plus point nine six minus point two three. That's firm. Check up PVC. PVC check. Okay. Okay. TMC three. Trim returns to neutral. Clockwise on the transmission controller. Right. No MPVC. No MPVC. Okay. Starting two. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Pitch two. Start. Good. Yaw two. Start. Okay. Both good. Good. Good trim control. Minus point nine six. Plus point nine six. Minus point two three. Good. The MPVC. Station control neutral. Back to trim. Good. To zero. No MPVC. No MPVC. Okay. D-Max mode, rate 2. Station line control power 2, normal AC, DC. DC, DC. Back 2, main A, main B. D. Okay, D-Max, you got 3, rate 2. Okay, we'll proceed for final trim. <laughs> Mike's where we are. Okay, D-Max mode, 3, at 1, rate 2. At 1, rate 2. Yeah, we'll enter. Okay, we'll do the couple test options. Okay, proceed. Proceed. Plus two. Minus two. Zero. Plus two. Two. Zero. And we can hear and feel the uh, the engine kibble as we do the test. Right. Okay, it's okay. relay is cut in and trim the set. If the ice kill five five. Five five.
Better form than
it's been uh, pretty uh, interesting to doing all the camera work here to get a uh, little uh, extra training uh, running the TV here, hopefully, uh, for when we get it grounded for tomorrow. The monitor does make it uh, pretty easy, though. All right. Uh, that's uh, a real advantage in the cockpit. You're just a little bit dark. Uh, looks like uh, might help to have the f-stop run down about one increment. See how it yeah, comes out.
I guess right now, uh, basically, you probably have all the switches back in position and you're in the mode to uh, continue on with uh, what does the flight plan say? You're going to be doing uh, this lunar navigation. So, Jack, you'll be down in the uh, LED, is that correct? Uh, that's right, Sam. I'll be going down there shortly. Okay, the TV now is uh, is all but black. Uh, looks like it must be pointing into a shadow. Uh, what are you doing now? He's trying to give you one more shot of the moon, and uh, right now I'm setting up to maneuver to the optics and calibration attitude. Roger. Yeah, what I uh, wanted to point out, I don't know if it's uh, apparent, uh, but uh, well, show the advantage of uh, doing all the dumps uh, just before the burn. Uh, we're looking again at the same thing, you know, we're quad one at the moon, and uh, now uh, you don't see all the uh, sparkly uh, frozen uh, particles out there, there anymore. we sort of run off and run them. All uh, right, uh, we, we don't see anything out there in, anymore in the way of particles leaving the spacecraft. Uh, we'd suggest uh, maybe you zoom the moon in a little bit uh, again so we can see the shape of it better. Okay, that brings the moon in. We can see the terminator at the top of the uh, melon-shaped disk. Okay, and uh, now you can see a few uh, spark, uh, sparkling particles going across the screen. Uh, those are uh, being emitted from the thrusters. Uh, Jack's uh, maneuvering the uh, spacecraft now. Okay, we can see those very poorly. Uh, well, actually, they're coming in better now. It looks like little specks going from the upper left part of the screen across to the right. And understand those are from the thrusters. That's right. Okay, uh, 13, uh, Houston, uh, just as an item of interest, advise your speed with respect to the Earth now is 4,667 uh, feet per second. Okay, thanks, man.
Okay, Apollo 13, Houston. Uh, the moon has been in and out of the, the our screen here. Right now, it's uh, off at the bottom side, but we can still see the particles coming off from the spacecraft. Okay, I'm going to have to pull it out of the window now, Vance. Uh, the sun's uh, coming up on the right side. All right, you understand you. Now to get down there with Fred to show you how it works. I keep floating up to help him. Maybe we can get a little shot here. Okay, uh, we have somebody upside down in the photograph there now. Realizing, of course, in uh, in space, uh, there is no really right side up or upside down. It still looks that way to us.